Jasmine, I understand you've got some more. Yeah, I want to take you through the timeline. So what happened from 2 p.m. on Thursday to around 3 p.m. on Friday? I want to bring in criminal defense attorney Philip Holloway. You were also a former prosecutor in Cobb County, Philip. So what we know, the couple left around 2 p.m., like I said, from Marietta, heading to McRae, Georgia. They were supposed to show up at, to watch their grandkids on Friday around 3. They did not show up. And now we know that suspect, and Natisha was just talking about, turned himself in. So what happens now? How are they going to fill in the gap in this drive? Well, one of the big questions is, does he have a lawyer? Because mm -hmm. if so, a responsible criminal defense lawyer is probably going to tell him, don't say a word. So if that's the case, they're not going to get any information because I guarantee you they're trying to interview him if possible. Mm -hmm. If not, they may very well be getting answers to all of these questions directly from the suspect himself. A lot of times people decide they're just going to open up and spill their guts if they've done something wrong. Nobody's accusing anybody of anything yet, but... This couple right here just doesn't disappear off the face of the earth with no explanation. And I really believe that this guy has the explanation. And how are, they, how are they tracking this couple's actions from the time that they disappeared? Well, everybody's got a cell phone in this day and age, and they mm -hmm. most of the time have a GPS device built in. So they have that. It's possibly that they refueled uh, at a gas station. So we have maybe credit or debit card transactions mm -hmm. on the way down from uh, Atlanta, Marietta area, all the way down to South Georgia. It's probable that they had to refuel by gas. We know that their phone uh, was in contact with his phone shortly before they went missing. So he is by all means the prime suspect. And although this has not been labeled as such, mm -hmm. Yasmin, I guarantee you it is a homicide investigation at this point. Yeah, Philip Holloway, a lot of unanswered questions. I'm sure we're going to be talking a lot about this over the next couple of days. Ali.